Good day, M4771. Please introduce yourself. Hi, my name is Maria Erika Piquez I'm 24 years old. I'm happily single. I'm also a Roman Catholic. My educational background is um, under, uh, under college for year, um, taking up the biology. Okay. I saw that you have experience here in the Philippines as a helper. What are your main duties? So, my main duties there is that um, I'm taking care of my the newborn baby and then also the elderly um, in the house. And then also I'm... Um, what household chores that you do? Um, cleaning outside in the... Um, inside the house. And then I'm also cooking and then um, go to the supermarket to buy things. Okay. I saw that you have experience taking care of one year old baby, right? Yes. How do you prepare a meal for a newborn baby? So I prepare for that. Uh, uh, first is that I'm I need to clean my uh, my hand, and then before I clean also the bottles and then sterilize it. And then I put the right amount of powder, uh, milk powder and then the water and then shake it properly. And then I, I check if the temperature of that water is appropriate for the baby. Okay, then you feed the baby. Okay, what will you do if the newborn is crying? So first is that I will check if the diaper is full, like if there is a pee and then the poop. And also if the baby is didn't um, um, feeling well, uh, I, I will check the temperature of that and then I will tell my the, the mother or the father too uh, that the baby is having a sick and then I will inform them if I, um, what will I will give the medicine for the baby. Okay. Um, why do you want to work in Hong Kong? So for that, um, uh, I need to earn for my future and then also um, to support my family in okay. the Philippines. Okay. How long do you want to work in Hong Kong? So if the um, at the end of the top contract or the if the, my employer is uh, wants me to um, to continue my job. Okay, if the employer wants you to stay with them, it is okay for you to stay. Yeah. Okay, do you know how to cook Chinese food? Um, no, I'm not familiar with that um, Chinese cuisine, but I'm willing to, to learn. Um, there's uh, YouTube or that Google, and then I will um, um, observe if my employer is cooking, and then I will observe that. So that you can learn? Yes, okay. I can learn. Okay, if the employer prepared some food that you are not familiar with, it is okay to you to eat the food that they prepared for you? Uh, yes, as it, long as it's the uh, employer and that eating also. Okay, <laughs> it is okay to you to share jobs with other helper? Sir? It is okay to you to share jobs with other helper? Uh, yes, of It course. is okay to you to um, uh, share room with kids? Uh, yes, of course. If the employer wants you to work on Sunday or in a holiday setup, it is okay to you? Yes, is it okay? it's okay for me also. Okay, it is okay to you to take care of elderly, help them go to bed, help them go to the bathroom, and also help them go to the hospital for uh, checkups. Yes, sir. Yes, I can. Do okay. That also. If one of the member of your employer don't know how to speak English, it is okay to you to learn Cantonese. Yes, um, I'm willing to learn that. The, their language. <laughs> the language. Okay. Also, yeah. Okay. Next uh, question. Last. My last question is: What will be your message for your future employer? So my message is that um, honestly, I I am trustworthy person, and then I'm also a hardworking person. So um, I I will do my best to help to provide help for your family, and then take care of them, um, and then. And okay, you can you will promise that you will yeah. also take take care, uh, take care of the family as your own family too. Yes, yes, I will. Okay. Thank you. Thank you.
Yes, I can do that also. Okay, thank you very much, M4771, Miss Maria Erica. Thank you, Paul.